Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Living With Me Now. But before I continue, I just want to say, please, pardon on this little, there is no chair, no table in my room. So just pardon me. So if you're new here, hi, welcome to the family. And please don't forget to like, share, comment, and most importantly, please do subscribe. So from the title, you know that I'll be talking about my school GU and what you should expect. For those of you that don't know yet, I'm a transfer student. I transferred from a state school in the state university in science and technology, and I'm currently in GU Gregory University in Abia State. So I'm going to be sharing with you some of the things that I didn't know before coming to this school, or some of the things that maybe I found out through TikTok or YouTube because I watch a lot of TikTok about this school. Um, I need you to, in all, I'm going to tell you what you should expect before coming to this school. <laughs> so, Prof, I'm doing a video. I'm going to be sharing with you things to expect before coming to my school, very good university to me. So, number one on the list is that there is no water. Like, it's not as if today there is water to me, there's no water rushing. You always have to fetch your water. Water is out, um, always provided. You know, tankers come to the school and give you water, but you always have to fetch it. No water is washing inside the restaurant for you. That one, I was shocked. Like, I didn't know. It's when I came to school, I realized. So, number two, um, yes, <laughs> my roommate said she had this one the child by different colors, different sizes, different levels of education. So, just get ready to open. People meeting up and checking you, right? If you don't know what check means, I mean, people meeting, meeting up with you and then flirting with you. That's what check means. And then I'm going to talk about the rooms. The rooms, there are bunks. There is no, there is no like separate bed. Even if you pay for a man room, they still give you bunk. And currently, this is my bunk. You know, it's like a bunk. You can see that. So, this is a bunk, and you always get to have bunks. And like if it's a two man room like my room, that's like two fifty K room. For this new single, for my room, two hundred K, six man, one fifty, eight man, hundred K. That's how it is. Hundred thousand, K is thousand. I think you do that. So and you can come back to the hostel anytime. There's no time like in my former school, one system, you don't leave the don't come inside, go here. Anytime, anytime. I can come back by two, leave us there by three. You know, just close the door when you're leaving. <laughs> That's just it. And then the subjects here, when I came here, I thought it would be something with my former year because in hundred level, I did like nine, eight subjects first semester, nine subjects second semester. But here, I did like about 15 subjects in 200 level, even also 100 level, 15 subjects. That was a lot. And here, they do pen and paper in 100 level. Um, you write pen and paper. In my under level, we did CBC throughout, except in my BCH, which was my you know, main course. I, did, I had to write pen and paper, but in other courses, it was even maths, it was CBT. But here, you have to write down everything. So, um, the next one I'm going to talk about is food. You know, in this school, you don't cook, so you always have to buy food. So, there are three cafeterias provided for me. One is the girls' cafeteria, the two are in West cafeteria. Why I'm saying, why I call this girl, why they call it girls' cafeteria, it doesn't mean that, it doesn't mean that boys can't enter. Boys can enter, but like it's in girls' campus. This is divided into like both boy and girls' campus. So it's closer to the girls' hostel. That's what I'm trying to say. So why the boys' um, cafeteria is not the best cafeteria? So um, all food is for the Girls don't do anything like extra food. Like, you know, in boys' cafeteria, I can be like, okay, I want extra. That's Extra is 500, and if you want double extra, 600. But all food claim is 400. Girls don't do extra. They, they give you 400 and food, which is big in some cases. So, yes, you can do extra 500. Can. It always comes with meat. Let me set the video. That's a very tiny chunk of meat. You can come with egg. Let me set the video. Yes, you can come with either meat or egg. You can. Buy your chicken if you want chicken. Buy drinks. You know, do what to do you. But what it will give you for your four hundred naira just to grab. And then if you come to school and you like spaghetti like me, the best spaghetti is the second best cafeteria. 
and get to it. I think that's the best place to buy food in this school. While the second to the best is just the thing, the least is the first to the But then we go there. If, if it's only in the house for getting, don't go there. Other food, yeah, you can find it there. And boys, second boys cafe is the best. That's like the most proud one. And then people sell, like in the hostel, people can come and sell you food. Like I just got my plantain cheese. The woman that sells clothes, I just got my plantain cheese. This plantain cheese like this 100 naira. This is 100 naira too. So, yeah. And as a student, if you want to do business, you can do business. I never knew this to do business in this school. And then people are like, oh, I got my tote bag. I'm going to set a, 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 a picture. Yes, I got my tote bag inside this school. Um, you can buy jewelry, tote bag, make your hair, do your nail. That like students do all this stuff. So if you not to do any of those, you're going to make cool cash. Then um, parties, there are a lot of parties that happen. GE is not for parties. Like, that's what I knew GE was not for people going to school. Because when I checked on TikTok, I mean, GE do parties, GE do parties. But I'm going to tell you this if you're here for books, exactly, please, do your second semester. Don't attend all the parties. If you attend all the parties, attend, attend one or two. Don't attend all the parties because some people tend to carry over courses in second semester because they make a lot of, they do a lot of parties, organize a lot of parties in second semester. Second semester has not officially started, so I've not witnessed this yet. But that's what people say. A lot of people have to read. A lot of people have to read. Like a lot on TikTok and a lot of people. Second semester, they do a lot of parties. People can't go back to more than second semester. And then, hair making. Students make hair. There's this woman that makes hair too, but like, people that make hair is good. <laughs> Um, one thing that shocked me this was when I wanted to go for Saturday class. You know, I just casually, like, they were like, I don't know, I was like, let me not just do too much, but let me still dress casually. Do you understand? So I wore, like, a top, you know, leggings, and then sandals. And I'm reaching there, I'm sitting wearing slippers, crocs, cargo pants, um, crop top and cargo pants. And then it turned on me that <laughs> once it's Friday and Saturday, Friday, Friday, you don't wear departmental wear. The fact that Saturday can wear anything you want to wear. You can look up and start going to class. You can wear anything. I don't know for Friday. Yes, I'm not, I don't know for Friday because I've never remember attended lecture on Friday. I've only attended lecture once and that was on Saturday. You can wear anything, anything for that Saturday class. Anything, literally. You can order food. Um, if you don't really feel comfortable with this food, you can order food outside, order food outside, and then they bring it inside. Like, you know, I order my tools, and then they bring me a virtual year for me. So you can use the DH, you know, or you can have like an Okada man's number. I can go and pick up your things from like, the IBM and that's it, like the boss. You know, when you do reviews in the boss. And you can also order food outside and then make it your business. You know, order food outside, come with school, and then add your own small change on top of the food they order and sell. But make sure. Make sure to get orders before OG outside now. And then, um, I mean, because when I came to this family, like, oh my god, did they have like an SUG president? Um, my pharmacy, like the president of Pan, like how to get elected. Then. And then I was trying to have people like do manifestos and um, stuff like that, but they don't. You just if you do well in school, now yeah, depends on your grades. If you do, if you're the highest, you get the SUG position, you get the President of Pan's position. So that one scared me. And these are the things that you should know before coming to GU. And for the hostel, the use of the hostel, you don't get like electric kits. You just anything electrical you get in just of your iron. Nothing else. Don't get any electric toaster or this thing. No, just your iron. That's the only thing. Your chargers and your lamps. Those are the only things you're allowed to bring. You don't, you're not allowed to drill. And find out that one is certain. Not actually. Took me. <laughs> Took me inside this boy. Not actually. Found the inside like, oh, how many things inside this one. So that just is in this school, you have the churches, you have the people stuff. I think it's house of the Lord, there's assemblies and scaffolding, there are money masses. Church is not compulsory, even go church to go. This school is also friendly to Muslims. All the guy, there is a mosque here, but I think if you take permission and go to the mosque. So guys, that's all. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Like, share, comment, and most importantly, subscribe to my next video. Bye. What does you want to know about my school? Tell me in the comment section. Bye. <laughs>